Once upon a sunny day, many animals lived peacefully in the forest. Luna, a cat, was respected by other animals in the forest and wanted to be friends with all of them. On the other hand, Toby, a mouse, lived in fear of bigger animals. These two lived without even knowing about each other. Then, one day Luna discovered Toby and became curious, while Toby was cautious of Luna. He also felt a fondness for her friendly attitude. Luna started talking to Toby, saying, Hello, I'm Luna. I'm a cat who lives here. What's your name? Toby replied. I'm Toby. Talking to a cat. That's really unbelievable, Luna responded. We might be different, but it doesn't mean we can't be friends. I want to be friends with all the animals. But you're a cat, and I'm a mouse, said Toby. Can there be friendship between us, Luna replied. Why not? Let's get to know each other better and build our friendship so. They cautiously began to explore each other's worlds. Luna gave Toby many peanuts, and Toby showed Luna hidden paths in the forest. Their friendship deepened day by day. However, other animals in the forest mocked the possibility of their friendship. Despite these reactions, Luna and Toby trusted and relied on each other, realizing that friendship is about acknowledging and respecting each other's differences. One day, danger came to the forest. A fierce eagle started threatening the animals. When the eagle threatened the forest and all the animals were scared, the two friends decided to save the forest. Toby, the eagle is threatening our forest. We have to do something, said Luna. But Luna, I'm too small to do anything, replied Toby. Luna reassured him, no, Toby, your small size will be a big advantage for us. I'll carry you on my back to where the eagle is. You need to find the eagle's nest through a small gap. All right, we can do this together, agreed Toby. Thank you for believing in me, Luna said Toby gratefully. Luna carried Toby on her back, climbed tall trees, and reached where the eagle was overlooking the forest from a high point. Luna carefully set Toby down. Here, Toby, I'll distract the eagle. Here you find the nest and carefully slide the eggs out of the forest. Then, the eagle will leave our forest, instructed Luna. It's a success, exclaimed Luna. All the eggs are safely moved. Well done, Toby. Now our forest is safe. The eagle won't threaten us anymore, cheered Luna. After the eagle left the forest to find its eggs, thanks to the actions of the two friends, peace returned to the forest, and the friendship between Luna and Toby deepened. Through this confrontation, Luna and Toby showed everyone that two different beings can come together to solve big problems. I hope today's story brought you joy and happiness. I'll come back next time with an even more special story. Thank you for watching.